All right, doggy, we just, we're out here catfishing. Yo, we just caught a big one. Keep real on a man. Yo, he's coming Mikey in. Mikey out here ripping him in, doggy. <laughs> yeah, dude, I told you, man. We just had to wait for it, dog. Yeah, heavy Yo, check him out, man. Dude, are we roasting him up, dog? I can't fucking pull him up. Oh, nice, mate. Sweet. That's a huge <laughs> fish right there, boy. man. All right, we're eating well tonight, boys. All right, so we just got the catfish. We uh, about to start a fire and skin them up. And then we're going to be making some fish tacos. Yeah, fish tacos are going to be good. good. Let's build up some embers so we can get this oil going. All right, we got the fire going. Now we're gonna start preparing this catfish. Mm. He's about 10. 10 pounds? <laughs> yeah. Okay, he's not coming out. Quality meat. Mikey don't need pliers. He's got his own hands. All right, he's about done. We're just gonna fillet some of the meat off now. Do this beautiful. That's some good meat right there. Oh yeah. You did not. <laughs> what the hell? Look at that slab. Pretty decent. We got another one to go, and we can definitely salvage some more off the, uh, the, the tail. Let's check that out. Looks really good. And this, we're gonna save this part and uh, cook it with the bones on it later. We're gonna be making some fish tacos out of this catfish. And we got all the ingredients here. Mikey's getting that ready. Got some eggs, some breading, some tacos, some cheese, some lettuce, and we have the fish. And we're gonna be uh, boiling it in peanut oil over there. So what we got here is, uh, I'm about to season up these fillets um, with just some basic salt and pepper and garlic powder. We love garlic powder at Urban Hunters. So next up, we're gonna take these fillets that are all seasoned. We're gonna run them through over here. You gotta get them all submerged in this egg. And try not to overflow it. Once we egg, extra that, protein, extra flavor. You're gonna run it in through the breadcrumbs. And the reason you do the egg first is because the breadcrumbs wouldn't stick to the fish otherwise. All right, second fillet. All right, now these are ready to go. Now we gotta get this oil on the fire, get it up to 350 degrees. All right, it's at 350, so we're gonna go ahead and toss them in. Ooh, nice. Already looks tasty. Can I get more tin foil? Yeah. yeah. Don't drop it, boy. That was cooking for very short. Okay, it's already looking real good. Our tacos are just toasting up right now. Got to lather them up in ingredients. All right. Let's get this rolling. Nice and over toasted. Smells good. because you need to be healthy in the outdoors. Iceberg lettuce, the best for you. Take them out for the fish. Take the knife and just cut those in half.
can't forget the chefs, the master who actually got the kill. Gotta load him up fat. Yes, sir. Mikey's gotta take the honors because he made the kill. Soak all the oil off of him. But it's all good. Looks super tasty. First mm. impressions? Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's all we need to hear. Really good. The catfish couldn't have been cooked much better. And the lettuce is really crunchy. And the cheese, the four cheese Mexican blend is the way to go. All right. Really good. I need, I'm so hungry. I need to get some of this. All right, Casanova. Moe's taught me how to roll this way. Check that out. They're cute. Cutie. Mm. <laughs> Super That's what good. I'm talking about. Super good about to eat a couple of these. Really easy to do. This only took us about 20 minutes to get to the point where we are now. Really doable for camping trips. Just bring some peanut oil, a little, little pot like this, some eggs, and some seasonings. You know, tortillas, cheese, and lettuce, and you'll be good to go. Mm-hmm. Definitely a good kill. We'll be doing this again. Maybe we can try some different fish next time. But the catfish is really tasty. Definitely. Thank y'all for watching. Urban Hunters out. <laughs>